Over in Japan, Shinzo Abe vowed to reprise his role as the man in charge of the ruling party, meaning the prime minister will go toe-to-toe -to -toe against the nation's former defense chief for that post. According to our Kim Yo-san, this isn't the first time the two are facing off. Japanese Prime Minister Shinzo Abe confirmed Sunday that he'll seek re-election as leader of the ruling Liberal Democratic Party in September. It sets the stage for a two-way race against Japan's former defense minister Shigeru Ishiba, who announced his intention to run earlier this month. Ishiba has promised to engage in fair and honest politics. As the leader of the ruling party becomes a de facto prime minister of the country, if Abe wins, it will be his third term as the leader of the LDP, and he'll be on track to become Japan's longest serving prime minister. Abe and Ishiba contested in the previous election in 2012. The main focus of the debate is likely to be the amendment of the Constitution, in particular Article 9, which bans the maintenance of armed forces. Abe has repeatedly highlighted the need to clarify the role of the self-defense forces and hinted he'll submit the amendment bill to the extraordinary diet session this fall. Yet a survey conducted by Japan's Kyoto News Agency shows only 36.7 percent of the Japanese people are in favor of the amendment bill proposed by the ruling party, with nearly 50 percent opposing it. The poll also shows some 36 percent said they support Abe as the leader of the LDP, while 31 percent support Ishiba. With the official campaigning scheduled to kick off on September 7th, it remains to be seen whether Abe can secure a third consecutive term as the leader of Japan's ruling party. Kim san Arirang News.